If you have a block of ice and supply heat to it, its temperature will increase. The particles vibrate faster, which means they gain in kinetic energy. However, once it reaches the melting point of zero degrees C, its temperature will remain constant until it's all melted. Only then will its temperature start increasing again. The same thing happens when it reaches 100 degrees and it turns into a gas. During a change of state, the particles don't gain kinetic energy, but rather potential energy. We say that any substance has internal energy. That's the sum of the kinetic energy and potential energy of all particles in a substance. You need to know this definition. Only one of these can change at a time. An increase in temperature means we must have an increase in kinetic energy of the particles, while a change in state, when heating anyway, must mean an increase in potential energy. We have equations for both of these energy changes. Specific heat capacity, this tells you how much energy is needed to raise one kilogram of a substance by one degree Celsius. SLH of a substance tells you how much energy is needed to change the state of one kilogram of it. 